Francis Obiquello, but of course that has been equaled by Jimmy Vaco recently. It is 9.86. But there's nothing slight about uh, Jimmy Vico. Richard Kilty pacing up and down. He's been jogging all the way down, rehearsing the way he's going to perform this race. It'll be tough for him. So. Bokari and Vico. These are great moments of preparation. Solomon Bokari and that's Martina. So the two Dutch athletes in this. That's Guliev of Turkey. Bokari then introduced uh, to the crowd the transferee from Sierra Leone. 10.20 his best this season. He's got the outside lane away from the pressure. And Guliev, Ramil Guliev of Turkey from Azerbaijan, sixth in the European Championships last year at 200 metres. Disqualified in this race last year in the 100. Richard Kilty. Quick out of the blocks, a former world indoor champion, reigning European indoor champion. But the man to watch as well will be Jack Harvey of Turkey. Jack Harvey, former Jamaican, semi-finalist in the World Championships last year, won the Stockholm Diamond League, but this man is uh, a classy act. Well, Jimmy Vico has not smiled the whole time he's been out there. He's really deep in concentration. He's got the six lane, and uh, James Ellington has moved from 200 to 100 meters and getting great success. Personal best in qualification for this final. Truly deserves his place. Gerandi Martina, fourth in the European Championships, 200 meters last year. Semi-finalist in the World Championships at one and 200 meters. A great servant of uh, the Netherlands. And Hortelan of Spain, right on the outside lane. And uh, Hortelano, I should say, the Spanish record holder at both 100 and 200 meters. Bokari, Guliev, Kilti, Harvey, Vico, Ellington, Martina, and Hotelano. The men's 100 meters final. On your mark. Now, who? Who? The crowd. Of Turkish support here. Now, who has been the guilty party? Let's have a look. Naught point. Oh, it's Richard Kilty. It's Richard Kilty. Less than 0.1, and Richard Kilty may well find that he's not in this uh, European final. It's, uh, he's the only one on the reaction times that we've just seen. Just the slightest, let's look, third from the top. Well, I didn't see anything at all from that, I must admit. Nothing at all. But he's triggered something. Now, what are they gonna do? Officially, on the statistics, he should go. It's two one thousandths of a second. Yeah, I know, and here comes, let's see what he's got. I'm just praying that it's a green card and that something else happened, but I don't think so. It's red, I think. It is red. And Richard Kilty is gone. What a shame. Disqualified in the European final. There was no obvious movement whatsoever. I have to say that. But just two one-thousandths of a second. Well, what a shame. What a shame. 
So let me remind you of the lineup. Bokhari of the Netherlands, Guliev of Turkey, then the empty lane vacated by Richard Kilty, Harvey of Turkey, Vico of France, Ellington of Great Britain, Martino of the Netherlands, and Hortolano of Spain. The European men's 100 meters final. No problems uh, with the start. Harvey got a very good start indeed. Ellington's going well, and Ellington's going well along the side. Ortolano as well, but Harvey's going to get this. I think Harvey gets it, I think. It was very, very close. Let's have a look. It was very close in the end. Was it Harvey? I tell you, he was finishing fast as well. Chirendi Martina, I'm not sure if he got it there in it time. Was. He did get it, Martina. Let's look and see. Martina did get it. It was between... Vico was just pushed out of it, Ellington was going well, Harvey was uh, beaten, it's exactly the same time, 10.07, 10.07. So the photograph has not been able to separate them. Harvey, I thought, got it, but Martina, the most experienced uh, sprinter on the track, has been given it. And Vico gets third at 10.08, so 10.07, 10.07, 10.08. Well, have a look at this. Watch Martina on the near side. Harvey next to Vico. I was watching them very, very closely. Ooh. That is... It's very difficult to tell. That was a tight one, wasn't it? Wow. One one hundredth of a second between the first three. And as they say, it is all on the dip and let's be honest Stuart on the evidence of today that has come out of nowhere absolutely I've seen him so many times but Vico I thought well will he come through and at the end of the day he had one of those off races a man who's run 9.86 and uh, equal the European record and uh, but uh, for them to be separated very difficult indeed Harvey I thought had got it but uh, certainly on the photograph you still can't really tell the difference because they've both given exactly the same time and uh, but you have to say that the experience of Chirandi Martina has taken it away from a man who most uh, gave as the favorite Jimmy Vico he got the bronze but my goodness me wow Harvey thought he'd got it I thought Harvey had got it Martina, as soon as the photographs came up, and it came up on the computer, that they both had the same time, but they've given the verdict to Chirandi Martina. And there are athletes around the world that you can say they are big day, championship final competitors. And this man's record shows that he fits that particular bill. He perhaps even came into this final as not the strongest sprinter on the day. But he has shown, that then you chuck in all those other elements, the unique ones when it comes to a championship final, when it requires more than muscle and speed and reaction, when it requires temperament, when it needs something, that little bit extra between the ears to get you across the line. Ellington in had an a good event. run early on. He, he certainly a, did, didn't he? he? Had a good run there. Vico wasn't going particularly well in the semi, but uh, the Spaniard on the outside was going well. Look how far Martina comes from the back. He's coming from the back very, very strongly indeed, but Harvey dipped in, and it did look as though he'd got it, and I still say that that is as tight as it gets. Look how far Martina is behind. A second from the left of your shot. Harvey must have thought he'd got it, and it's closed down right at the very, very end. Wow, that was a cracking race. Super race. Doesn't get any closer than that. 